again and welcome. You're watching Cruise First TV on Sky Channel 681, but you knew that already, I'm absolutely sure. I'm Derek, you probably knew that as well. This is Joe. you probably Hello. knew that as well. We are the only channel, if you are new to us on TV, that does nothing but serve up good news all day long by taking you around the world, not in 80 days. In fact, you can have as many days or nights as you fancy, to be honest. And the deals that we've got, you can book today from the comfort of your own home. And in this show, it's a total eclipse of the heart. Turn around bright eyes. Oh, I will. <laughs> Definitely. This will make you turn around. Uh, the sea, total eclipse of the sea is what we're going to do because we're setting sail with celebrity cruises. That's right, Bonnie. Uh, <laughs> sorry. Derek. Uh, for the next 30 minutes, we're going to be on board the fabulous Celebrity <laughs> Eclipse for three feature deals that take in the best of Canada, New England, as well as both the Southern and Eastern Caribbean. Now, we're going to be cruising all included, which means a classic drinks package, Wi-Fi and tips all factored into the prices coming your way. Plus, we've got deposits available from just £199 per person. So should we go cruising? Yeah, absolutely. Yes, if we can make it happen today with a low deposit, even though it might be quite away into the future like our first offer Brilliant. which is Canada and New England with a stay in one of the favorite places I love to say Boston. Boston. We're off to Boston. Um, it's 14 nights all told starts on the 17th of September next year and we'll fly you first to Boston <laughs> in Massachusetts. That's how they say Boston. No, it is. They do. Um, for two night pre cruise stay in fabulous Boston, full of history, full of great shopping, friendly people. It is fantastic, New England at its finest. You've got the Freedom Trail there, um, where you can learn all about the sort of early settlers. Also, you have, of course, the Tea Party Museum. You also have brilliant um, shopping, Quincy Marketplace. Love it incredible food lots of wonderful opportunities there for picking up souvenirs as well uh and cheers bar you've got to go to cheers bar where everyone knows your name right have your selfie done, taken outside for sure yes. um hopefully everybody remembers cheers out there if you don't you've got to look it up of course we uh, will do. Uh, yes uh, now we are boarding the beautiful and elegant celebrity eclipse for 11 fabulous nights all inclusive cruising this means your drinks um everything everything such as your you know your spirits your blended drinks if you're going to be getting cocktails um you've got things like your wines of course with dinner and your beers and your coffees and water it's all included uh your wi-fi as well as your tip so this makes a massive difference doesn't it to your adventure because you're not having to worry every single time you use your card is that going to be 15 dollars? is that going to be 20 dollars? you know this is wonderful now uh what have we got to enjoy on board the eclipse well there's just so much this is what we call modern luxury so it is that boutique hotel experience at sea. It feels very personal, despite the fact these ships are over 2,000 passengers, you still have that personal service um, and you have beautifully appointed staterooms as well incredibly comfortable mattresses. I mean, I can't even begin oh. to explain what a good night's sleep uh, you're going to have on I board. mean, pardon the pun, but a dream. They really are. And they, they even lovely rounded beds. It's just like it invites you in for a really, really comfortable night's sleep. It's absolutely fantastic. You're going to love yeah. the dining. Um, what I was just about to say, actually, about these ships is that you don't need to move quickly. You want to move slowly yeah. because you really want to enjoy and soak up the atmosphere of five star surroundings, but not five star surroundings where you're paying three, four hundred quid a night to stay in a room. Yeah. Not that kind of surroundings. And not the stuffy type of surroundings no. either. It feels very low key luxury, very yeah. relaxed. Um, the lighting designs all around the ship are specifically appointed to make you feel relaxed and at home. Oh, La Petite Chef, this is a wonderful experience that you, um, that is dining entertainment basically. So you need to book ahead, book early for that one if you can. The martini bar, do you love mixing? Do you love learning about mix mixology? Uh, well, they have the ice top bar there mm -hmm. and you can do great classes, including things like wine tasting and beer tasting for extra fees. You can find out all about that on board the ship. Um, and do speak to the shore excursions team because you're going to be heading to some um, ports with which are rich in history in Canada and New England. And you might want to book a tour to take you somewhere uh, that you have never been before. Of, co of course, speak to the team on board and they'll have some great suggestions. Wonderful. Yeah. I just saw a smoky old fashioned there, which really, Ooh. really looked appealing. So out of Boston we go. Into Rockland, USA in Maine for our first port here, uh, where you can go on the Harbour Trail or perhaps head out on a tour of the Rockland 
breakwater lighthouse. They're known for their lobster here too. You can actually try try a lobster roll. That's uh, like a brioche bun with lobster. Mm. Um, on into Halifax, Canada, which has one of the longest piers in any port, um, certainly in the northern USA. And along that pier, you have lovely boutiques, you have cafes, you have restaurants. Grab a uh, coffee and a donut in Tim Hortons. That's, of course, the famous coffee shop. Uh, then we're on into Sydney, Canada, in Nova Scotia, which has the perfect mix of metropolitan charm and downtown hospitality about it. Um, and, you know, it, it really has that lovely sprawling waterfront to welcome you into. This is kind of characteristic of these ports. Now we have an overnight in Quebec, uh, which is incredible. Now, this is a very inspirational place to visit and it has a metropolitan, metropolitan feel, but at the same time, you have that gorgeous European architecture uh, with the Canadian charm right there. There's vineyards and so much more to explore. Charlottetown up next, uh, Prince Edward, Nile, Edward Island. This is known for Anne of Green Gables, if you know that story. And you also have lots of beautiful historical buildings to visit, such as um, uh, Province House right there. Portland in Maine is our next port of call before we get back into Boston, where you can go to the Algash Brewery or perhaps the Portland Museum of Art, head to the Victoria Mansion or um, enjoy the Casco Bayline Ferry Terminal. So, and then we're back into Boston where you'll disembark and of course we'll fly you back home uh, to the US, um, to the UK rather, after your two fabulous, uh, two fabulous weeks. And of course you are gonna be taking in the changing of the seasons being there in September. So expect to see some beautiful golden leaves in these ports of call as well. Well, it's world famous uh, for those incredible uh, scenes of autumn or fall as they call it. What a trip. Yeah, it's why people want to go to this part of the world at this time of the year as yes. well. Um, in incredible, incredible opportunities. Uh, wonderful just to broaden one's travel horizons just a little bit as well. Um, it's funny, isn't it? We're always looking for new destinations somewhere that might not have been on the bucket list previously, but you look at these places and you think, actually, we've never really done that part of the world. We've been there, we've been there. Let's do something a little bit different this time. So this is coming up in September next year and included in the price I'm about to give you is the flight from the UK out to Boston in the States, of course, in Massachusetts. Two nights in a hotel there, room only, so you can freely explore that as you want to. Then you've got 11 nights of cruising on Celebrity Eclipse. Now, this is where it all goes five star and new luxury. And remember, while you're on board the Eclipse, right the way through your cruise, you've got your classic drinks package, you've got tips, your gratuities, and your Wi-Fi so you can keep in touch as well. But do me a favor, delete the news apps before you go. Use the Wi-Fi, but delete the news apps and forget those until you get back home again because it's not important. Just go and have a wonderful, wonderful holiday. Your cruise, of course, is uh, to Canada, including your overnight in Quebec City. We are talking about Canada and New England in the fall and our price will also, of course, include your flight back from Boston, very reluctantly, back to the UK. You can put a low deposit down on this today of just £199 each, which is amazing. And you know what? Considering the whole breadth of travel and the variety of what you're doing here, I think this price is very, very favourable. Um, when you start working out holiday prices, you try trying to plan holidays yourself, you soon get r completely lost and, and run away with price tags and that stops you from going anywhere, doesn't it? That, remember, is organised as one package from start to finish, from when you leave the UK to when you return back to the UK as well. Um, and remember, the cruise part of this is so taken care of, it's untrue, it's ridiculous. Um, right, let's have a look at upgrades then, shall we? Because you might well want to upgrade while you're on the cruise as well. So there are your prices going up to Ocean View, going up to Balcony and going up to a Sky Suite. Now your Sky Suite on this offer is in the Retreat class as well. And the Retreat class is really another world with celebrity as well. So it's not just the treat of having a suite as well, but it's having so many of your own unique um, amenities, if you like, your own deck space, your own restaurant as part of the Retreat class as well. So it really has that extra exclusivity. If you want to know more, please do speak to the team on 0800 953 4700. Remember, that's a free telephone call and we're here to talk to you seven days a week, our lovely friendly team. And they know everything, by the way. They've been on the ships, they've been to the destinations and they really are looking for the very best deal for you. It's not about 
our, our agents are not about lining their own pockets or our pockets. They're about finding you the very, very best value for money because we have so many customers in our customer base. We're a massive business. Um, it means that our buying power with the cruise lines, the airlines, the hotel brands around the world is so powerful that we can make you incredible savings that maybe you're not seeing elsewhere or where you're trying to arrange your own holidays. You're not seeing anywhere near that same kind of value. Well, welcome to Cruise First is what I say to you. And we are celebrity cruising in this show and no better place to enjoy, I think, the all included luxury of five star where literally there is not a care in the world yeah. than to go to a part of the world where it feels like, and we haven't been to the Caribbean yet, we're working on it, stay tuned, we're working on it, but the Caribbean to me feels like a place that when you get there, there's not a care in the world. It, it, that's the perfect way to describe it, Derek, because it's, it's, it's a no pressure holiday too. Mm. It's about just enjoying being present, yeah. the, the mm. whole experience of cruising. And of course, there's some incredible beaches and beautiful snorkeling diving destinations thrown in. Uh, but you're going to absolutely love this trip and enjoy it in style with all inclusive luxury on uh, Celebrity. So we're leaving on the 4th of November next year for 13 Fabulous Nights. This is your luxury Southern Caribbean um, and Miami stay adventure. So let's see, shall we? Let's see where we're off to. Well, we're heading to the Sunshine State of Florida for a three night pre-cruise stay in Miami. That's a good amount of time in Miami, actually. You know, you, you'll have noticed if, if you watch our show regularly, a lot of the Miami, Miami stays are just the one night. Three nights, that's kicking off your adventure in the finest way possible because you've got enough time to shop to enjoy the great dining options to head out and see some um, some culture and also perhaps even head out to the everglades on a airboat safari tour i love the winwood art district in miami it's spectacular you can see lots of incredible artwork and murals and they have great markets there but south beach itself is just such a remote you know it's such an incredibly unique place to visit you have the protected collins avenue Art Deco District, where literally, if you love architecture, building after building, you'll just be in just awe inspired. Then it's time to cruise. And we're cruising on board the beautiful Celebrity Eclipse for nine nights. What's better than a week? Nine nights. Now, this is your luxury, always included. And that means your drinks, your tips, and your Wi Fi are included. That, that means bottles of water before you're heading into port. That means your morning coffee, your Americano, your cappuccino in the cafe your wine with dinner, um, your cocktails, your blended cocktails, all of that fun stuff included, included, included. All enjoyed responsibly, of course, of one course. at a time. <laughs> but do you know what? The um, I love I love these ships and I love Eclipse uh, for the same reason I love the Solstice because she has the lawn club up on the top deck. It's beautiful, isn't it? The croquet I mean, up there. You've yeah. got such a relaxed kind of almost Mediterranean vibe up on the lawn club. How you cool is really that? And it's, it. and it's not plastic grass. Nope. Not at all. No offence if anyone has any. It's very effective here in the UK with our mixed weather. But it's real grass up on those top decks, which is incredible. Yeah. And listen, it, it's just like the book of luxury here. Page after page, every different direction you turn, whether you just grab and go at the Mars Grill there or you go for some speciality dining, um, little extra cover charge to go and enjoy things like Murano uh, with French dishes there with a brand new twist or the Tuscan Grill with its wonderful authentic authentic Italian meatballs, calamari, pizzas and butcher's cut mm, my steaks. My mouth's watering it right now. amazing. <laughs> it definitely does. And this, uh, this vessel actually won the Cruise Critic Cruiser's Choice Award for Best Large Ship, Best Cabins, Best for Fitness, Best for Shore Excursions. So you have some best, best, best here. And talking of, um, the, you know, the fitness, they do great fitness classes. They have a spa menu on board as well. So if you wanted to, you know, keep it healthy whilst you're on board, you have that option too. Especially in the hot weather, you might not feel like kind of having big heavy meals. They've got lots of lovely lighter meal options for you. Uh, Martini Bar, they're known for their cocktail celebrity. They mm -hmm. really are. So that's something you, you have there to enjoy as well. And, and the mocktails. Uh, and the wine selections, honestly. Oh, yeah. 
some of the biggest and deepest sort of wine cellars and wine varieties and the expertise that goes along with there's that smoky old fashioned again <laughs> oh i could just do that now oh. responsibly one at a time or that one whatever that was yeah that looks is it a good. mai tai that looked like a like something with blue curacao in it maybe Very good. Uh, great shows as well on board should we see where we're heading off to straight into bimini this is a bit of a newer um you know destination on most itineraries it's in the bahamas it's very unspoilt natural beauty you do have some history there to visit too but of course the bahamas is all about that paradisical ocean and um, then we're on to rangistad aruba uh, one of the abc isles we can head to de palm island maybe head out on the sea world explorer or do some shopping right there at renaissance mall for their tax and duty free purchases you, you diamonds liquor fine watches then we're into bonaire crelendic this is one of the top 10 destinations globally for diving and snorkeling expect to see some absolutely unforgettable marine life if that's what you enjoy head to the salt flats or off to see the flamencos at the wildlife reserve then we're on to Willemstad curacao now around mega pier they have lots of great shopping you pick up actually a lot of dutch favorites because it's a dutch antilly island but then those incredible brightly colored houses um, along the promenade and the queen emma pontoon bridge are a must so this is a little overview and remember it's luxury always included for you three fabulous nights in miami kicks off your adventure before before you head into Bimini Bahamas, the, the ABC Isles, you're hitting all three of them before back into fabulous Fort Lauderdale. So a lovely Southern Caribbean adventure for oh, you. Oh, and you're doing the ABC Isles in order. Look, That's Aruba, unusual. Bonaire, Curacao. Wow, that's amazing. That's almost like they planned it. They're my favorite islands in the Caribbean, Derek. I'm not surprised. Yeah. They look gorgeous. They look absolutely wonderful. So uh, November next year. Let me just paint a picture. Now, listen, we only do good news here. We only do good news and blue skies. But I want to take you to, it's a shame, Mr. P, you can't change this to grey every now and again because November next year, the sky ain't going to look like that, is it? Not going to look like that at all, is it? It's probably going to be quite dark, quite grey, or just that meh colour, you know, meh. Um, <laughs> it's not going to be great, is it? Start of November. Never great. You've got a long way to Christmas to go. It's a brilliant time to get away on your hollies, isn't it? On your holly bobs. So, included in the price I'm about to give you, which you can grab at a low deposit as well, by the way. So, the flight from the UK to Miami. You've got three nights in a hotel there, room only. Then you've got nine nights of cruising with Celebrity Eclipse around the Caribbean. And remember that um, cruise includes your classic drinks package. You've got your tips, so your gratuities and your Wi-Fi all included. And of course, at the end of the cruise, you will flight back from the States back to the UK. So it's £199 each today as a deposit. We'll secure the price tag. Um, are you guessing? OK, go on, throw me a number. No, don't be silly. Look, look at this. Look at 2199. Now, give us just £199 each today, and that price locked in includes the, the flights, the stay, the cruise, with uh, drinks, tips, and Wi Fi all factored in and included for you. That's the price you pay, and a deposit today of just £199 each. And remember, this is November next year, which is well over a year into the future but you can say do you know what we'll put a deposit down right now and we know that's happening for next winter i mean listen we can find you a deal for this winter just as easily but to know now that you've got this price locked in because you know the price of everything exactly so if we can get a price like that locked in today with a low deposit happy days are here again did you just do thumbs up again honestly so 80s uh let's do the <laughs> update or uh, the upgrade should i say uh there's your upgrades up to ocean view balcony and the sky suite sky suite again on this one is retreat class retreat class is just amazing it's everything you ever wished for and so much more as well um speak to the team if you want more details there we've also put the solo price there on the screen as well 0800 953 4700 and we must move on immediately but we are are going to the Caribbean again. In fact, if I'm right, I think this next offer would almost come off the back of the last one, actually. You could possibly do both. That's anyway, what I'm thinking. It's the Eastern Caribbean with the Miami stay. It's yeah. 14 nights, 22nd of November next year. And we fly you to Miami again. Three nights in a hotel in Miami before you cruise this time. Lovely. Um, do you know what? Miami fascinates me because there are some places that you look at in America and you go, I know 
what I would expect in America. We've all got pictures in our mind of how New York would be, how San Francisco, how Las Vegas would be. Miami seems a little bit of an enigma, but a fascinating one, Joe, as well. It, it, it is a bit of an enigma, and it's where, truly, it's where America meets Cuba, Spain, yes, Mexico. It's a real melting pot. It's a isn't real it? melting pot. It's yeah. very Latino inspired. Um, you know, um, you've got a lot of different cultural influences, but a, a lot of um, Latinos gravitated to this part. So that means incredible food, lovely hospitality, lots of fun, beautiful architecture. It is a really special place to visit. Incredible. And Southern Florida has wonderful weather. Then we are joining the Celebrity Eclipse, and you have 10 fabulous nights on board enjoying, um, you know, luxury. Eastern Caribbean adventure this time and we mentioned we touched on the lawn club before which is a wonderful place to go up and you can play croquet up there which is super fun they do these little picnics you've got the um, you've got a really well stocked library because the celebrity cruises it's not just about reaching the destination it's about voyaging as well and it's about you know while you're there learning perhaps about the culture and history and they do have lecturers on board um, alongside your shore excursions team they'll talk you through and they'll do a really interesting sort of historical talk uh, taking you into the ports of call and what you can expect and, and what you might like to book as well so you can plan your time and money in port effectively even before you arrive in the destination so then you're maximizing your time in port um, in every way possible yeah it's very very true and, and do you know what if you've never cruised with celebrity before um, it will be one of those once bitten forever smitten kind of um, affairs you so will chic. you will just love it because it's builders five star I think a lot of people think to themselves well okay the kind of people that will be there then might not be my kind of people well let me tell you it is absolutely everyone this is about this isn't about kind of country club kind of you know clientele this is about everyone that cruises but do you know what one thing they all have in common is they are just bathing and indulging in what we've worked hard for what we've yeah. deserved and actually treat yourself to a good holiday i think there's a lot of areas of our lives where we can save money and we can economize and everything else and of course we're having to but actually when it comes to holidays that is the time to say you know what i need this and i want this and i'm going to and i'm going to just enjoy it and absolutely and also when you factor into the equation you are getting your drinks your tips and wi-fi included yes. in the price point yes. you look at that price point you think that's a little elevated of what you know maybe you've seen some other offers don't forget you're saving hundreds really a day well yeah it, i mean it, it does it does mean yeah. that, that you know every time you go to a bar and enjoy a drink even you don't have to be a big drinker at all for that to be value for money um, it's not going onto your account. It's yeah. not racking up. It's not presenting you with a bill when, you know, at the end of the cruise, which is great. So 10 nights on board the Eclipse then. Yes, absolutely. And we're straight into Tortola in the British Virgin Islands for your first uh, port of call. They have a great shopping area right by the ship for tax and duty free. You might want to head to Virgin Gorda though for their famous rock formations and snorkeling. Really relaxed vibe here. St John's Antigua is up next. It's known for its gorgeous Dickerson Bay. If you can head to that beach, I'd highly recommend it. Uh, horseback riding on the beach, which I've done, is an amazing experience. And of course, there's the lush rainforests where you can zip line. Uh, we're into Bridgetown Barbados, which is an absolute favorite amidst uh, British travelers. You've got the Harrison's Cave that there, Doctor's Cave Beach, Segway experience, Atlanta submarine, and luxury shopping in Lime Grove as well. Uh, we're into Rossau in Dominica next for you, which is the nature island, um, which is awash with incredible rainforests, beautiful waterfalls, and stunning beaches. Um, and the Montreux Piton National Park is the place to go. Um, we're on to Basseterre St. Kitts next, which has more monkeys per capita, they say, than people. You will see them everywhere. They are adorable. Uh, you can take an island safari on a four by four, or perhaps head to the Brimstone Hill Fortress for lovely views over the whole of the island. So this is an overview for you. And not forgetting, you're flying into Miami, you're getting that hotel stay included, which is great three nights, heading all the way through uh, the best of the best here in the Eastern Caribbean, which is fantastic before you head back into Fort Lauderdale and we fly you home and luxury is always included on celebrity so that's drinks tips and wi-fi and in step with that actually the the first two days of the cruise are at sea the last two days of the cruise are at sea and for me that's a massive plus point because actually when you start a cruise 
you almost forget how busy your life is day to day to day and sometimes actually you need to slow down, chill out into the cruising pace of life which is relaxing and indulgent and five star and you should be enjoying every second of all the facilities and the wonderful pools and restaurants and shows and, and just everything that is part of a celebrity cruise and really kind of dive into it, swim around in it and enjoy it. It's going to be incredible. Uh, and of course, it's taking you around the Caribbean as well. So this is for November next year. And I did work out actually our second offer, um, the one before and this one, you could kind of, you could combine both one way or another, take a little bit of, you know, weaving and but it will work definitely anyway as this offer is included in the price will be the flight from the UK out to Miami we've got three nights in a hotel here in Miami room only and then 10 nights of cruising on Celebrity Eclipse around the Caribbean with your classic drinks tips and Wi-Fi included plus of course the flight back from the States at the end of the cruise another one where £199 each today We'll get that secured as a deposit and the price tag again is just exceptional and I need you to see it because it is so, so good. When you work out how many nights you're away, how many nights you're on the cruise and everything else and the fact that this is, when we say um, new luxury and modern luxury and five star and all of that, normally when you stay at a five star hotel, it's hundreds of pounds for just one night and it's just, it's just the room, it's just the room. Lovely room may it, though it may be, you can't really enjoy it, can you, in the same kind of way as if your whole holiday resort is five star and it's all included in that price as well. You've got so much more freedom that comes with that. Let's have a look at your upgrades as well. So if you want to go from inside to ocean view to balcony or even up to that wonderful sky suite up in the retreat class where you have your exclusive restaurants, uh, your own resort deck, and so many extra amenities and services as well. All the prices are there for you. Remember, you can put a deposit down now from as little as £199 per person. Gets that price locked in, gets that deal locked in for you. Um, because you know, the world's a funny old place these days. You can never predict from one day to the next, can you? What, what will be the price of so-and-so tomorrow? Who only knows? But what we're doing right now is kind of keeping you ahead of uh, the curve because Inevitably, as travel normalizes and it's still normalizing again after, you know, after a period of, well, slight flux, let's call it. <laughs> um, and so price travels, uh, travel prices are rising. There's no uh, doubt about that. We, we've kind of kept you the right side of that curve as much as we possibly can, which is why these low deposit offers right now are ranging further in advance we never used to arrange holidays like two years in advance, but we're doing it now because we're locking in great deals yeah. um, and the travel companies are well aware of that as well. So they're opening up the itineraries, you know, right the way now into the back end of 2025. And that's a great thing. We never used to be able to do that. It's just a win-win situation, yeah. Derek, isn't it? Because Definitely. you've got your, you're just putting the deposit down, you've got till your due date, which could be honestly two years into the future anyway. Mm -hmm. And that means that you're not having to think at the time, like, oh, hang on, I can't afford a holiday. Mm -hmm. Look how much everything's gone up. Get, get ahead of the curve, get ahead of the, let's, let's be honest, um, inevitable price hikes and we can help you tailor your trip exactly how you want it yes so speak to our team because they are phenomenal at what they do we've been doing this a long time and any adventure that you can dream up we can make happen for you i mean maybe not into galactic travel just yet but well i mean know, who knows never say never never <laughs> say never <laughs> Cruise first into space could be a thing. You know, who it knows? Uh, we all live and learn. Anyway, <laughs> stay right where you are. We've got many more offers on the way. Thanks so much for now, and we'll see you back here a bit later. See you soon.